What's up, you guys? This is part two of Sage's Rise of the Phoenix. It, I had to delete some space off my drive, so I apologize. Okay, so um, I already did disclaimers. If you need disclaimers, go back to the first video, okay? So I'm just going to jump right into it. So um, honor and respect will come to you. Um, one of you guys is about to report a pedophile ring. A bunch of masculine, sexist people made a bunch of money off of children's backs. Uh, very, They became very wealthy off of inappropriate photos or videos or something exploiting and abusing children, basically. And feminines that take on heavy masculine. One particular drag queen. And fems that take on heavy masculine and one particular drag queen. So masculine sexist energies and one and feminine that takes on heavy masculine and one particular drag queen. Um, you know this and you're about to stand up in a huge way. You know this and you're about to stand up in a huge way. So masculines that uh, are very sexist and fems that take on heavy masculine and one particular drag queen. So I feel that could be a trans energy or a femme that takes on heavy masculine or masculine sexist. How that resonates, okay? But honor and respect will come to you when you report these uh, pedophile people, uh, this pedophile ring. Um, some reason you didn't do it in the past, but you're about to stand up and do it now, Sagittarius. Um, I, I feel cycles have changed, changed, things have changed, and hopefully, hashtag save the kids. Just saying, just saying, okay? I think this is going to be a new experience for you, reporting this pedophile ring. For some, I feel you can have evidence like the pay-to-play link or photos or videos or links to dark web activity or something of that nature, however that resonates and applies, okay? Um, whatever evidence you're going to provide in the report um, for this. But you're about to get honor and respect for doing this. For one, it's betrayal of a family member, but a very low vibrational family member. I've been trying to set up their sister for years. Okay, for one of you guys, it's a um, betrayal of a family member, but the family member you're about to betray, they apparently have been trying to set up their sister for years. So, um, But it sounds like they were a masculine takes on heavy femme or a sexist masculine or a drag queen in this mix. So you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard they've been trying to set up their sister for years. Um, but they're part of some kind of nasty, dirty pedophile ring. And, you know, I feel they could have, you know, my God, gained new vehicles off this shit or property or properties off this shit or whatever. I mean, it's really sickening. It's sickening. Miracles. For one, you're about to get out of a very toxic marriage. You stayed in for it for material reasons. But through many series of shame events, you're about to just let it go. Very toxic, very toxic, and you stayed in it for years. Secretly gay husband. But it's not so secret. Many people know he's gay. And you know this. Okay. Well, okay, Sagittarius. So you can be a man or a woman, but your husband is gay. Uh, heard it's secretly gay, but not so secret because everybody knows he's gay. So not so secret anymore gay. You can be a man or a woman married to this uh, not so secret gay husband, or you can be a femme. But um, I heard you stayed in it for years. You're unhappy. You're miserable. You stayed into it for it for materialistic reasons, I heard. But I heard um, also everybody knows he's gay. Everybody knows he's gay. I guess he was trying to hide the fact he was gay. But it's not secret. He is gay. Um, and so I heard you stayed in for it for many years. Miserable. Miserable. But through many series of chain events, it sounds like you're about to file the paperwork, whether it's contested or non-contested. Miracle, you're about to get out of this marriage. Um, however that resonates and applies, I think you're going to have honor and respect will come to you. I don't know if you have kids with this person or not have kids with this person. Um, it doesn't sound like he likes 
vaginas. I mean, and I'm not trying to be crass. I'm just being for real. So for some, I feel you might have kids with him. For some, you might not. But uh, however that resonates and applies. But I think it's going to be a miracle that you're about to get out of this marriage. And for one, Sagittarius Feminine, you're about to find out your brother has been touching your children. Molestation. It is about to light a huge fire under your ass. A huge fire. You are going to create a series of chain events not to allow him over at your home. And you will probably reach out to someone he doesn't want you to reach out to with the information. Oh my God, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So one of you guys, your brother has been, okay, so one of you guys, your brother has been secretly molesting your children. And I think you have two or two plus children if this resonates for you. Um, your, your brother, so I think your biological brother or your foster brother has been secretly molesting your children, two or two plus children. Through many series of chain events, you're about to find this out. So I think the children are about to tell you or maybe some video camera footage is about to sh show you that uh, if you put video camera, foot, you know, you have cameras in your home or something and you see him inappropriately groping your child or children or touching your child in a no-no area or something like that. Um, or a, a report from your child or children or somebody in the household or what have you, what have you. Somehow you're about to find it out. Um, and um, I heard you're going to create serious chain events negative for him. I heard you're not going to allow him over. And you're probably going to reach out to someone he doesn't want you to reach out to uh, with the information. So um, honor and respect will come to you as far as taking action against your perverted brother um, to protect your children. Absolutely. And, and for one, you're going to protect your niece and nephew. This has gotten way out of hand. And for one, you're going to protect your niece and nephew. This has gotten way out of hand. So there's at least two of you. For one, you're going to protect, help protect your niece and nephew through this, too. So not only are your kids being touched, something to do with your niece and nephew, too. Um, however that resonates for one of you guys. Um, somebody's got a very perverted brother, uh, whoever you are. You've got a very perverted brother. For one, it involves your kids. Inappropriate no-no spot touching. For one, it involves your niece and nephew. So you have to plug it in how it resonates. All right, I'm getting out of this. I love you guys. I hope this helped, and namaste.